you, you ready to talk to you. We see you talking to you. Are you talking to you? Are you talking to you? You ready to talk to you. We see you talking to you. Talking to you, I'm talking to you. Talking to you. gonna do it and you're gonna see what's gonna happen i guarantee y'all i win i guarantee you i guarantee you it ain't gonna even be close i guarantee you don't want to close now go go get, you the, don't get, get it man. get the get the yeah, number two the last person we left off on was jc and uh i, I felt he was controversial because jc i think he could be a top 10 because he cleaned up his career like he um from 2015 to 16, remember he used to be known for battling a lot. But then 15 to 16, he kind of cleaned up, up his career. And, uh, yeah. He'd be winning battles and making classics. So I agree with the comment. You know, like, JC, he could be in he, he could be in the top ten if we if we don't want to be petty. Number 14. Right, because he definitely better than T Top and Sharon. Number 14, we got QB. Uh, we got QB number 14 on our list. How do you feel about this battle truth? Q B. The female? Yeah. Mm-hmm. yeah. <sighs> the see the thing about Q B is you got Q B mm-hmm. over jazz? Yeah. I ain't right feeling now. that one. Yeah. I ain't feeling that. I ain't feeling that. I ain't feeling that mm-hmm. at all. Based on what? I wouldn't Based put like, Q B you... over I wouldn't put Q B over jazz. Then you have you have E Heart beating Jazz. Then you have that too. Yeah, oh, but you know what's so cold about Jazz though? You know what's cold about right. Jazz? Even when she loses, she good. When she loses, she good. It don't like you. It ain't like you get a bad Jazz. When the fish who beat her, she still was good. I I I don't I don't I don't see it. I don't see QB so, better than Jazz. I think since 2015, uh, Jazz has maybe two battles. Right? She has the she has a Q. She has the uh, the official battle where she died. Well, lost bad. I don't think I don't know if she died. I think she won that. You last think she round. lost then, bad? I think she lost bad against official, bro. Like I think yeah, that's the first two rounds was fucked up. And then and then yeah. with E Heart, I think she did her thing. Maybe debatable, but I definitely had Heart winning. You look at QB. You are talking Arsenal, Show Off, and Official. And I think she won all three of those battles. Um, oh, oh, oh. To, the only yeah, I had a beat Arsenal. I had a beat official. You said what? Yeah, what about show off? You said what? I was I was saying <laughs> that um I I kind of think I think the only battle out of those three that she had that was actually you could debate is the official battle. Like I don't think I don't think the but, other but two are the, even. Yeah. But here's the thing about thing about QB. QB more disrespectful and not bars. I just, I hear, and, and I be listening, I be like, she's just doing a lot of cursing, but ain't really saying nothing, man. Wait, wait, she ain't really saying it. It's just a lot of cursing, but she ain't really saying nothing, man. But I, 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 I guess yeah, I true, can feel you true, coming. I don't, I don't want to. I don't want to cut you off on that, man. But I totally, I think the, I think the, the official and the show off in the Arsenal battle proved she could scheme and punch and do all the lyrical like crazy shit that a lot of these niggas can do and then add in the disrespect with it. That's why I thought Arsenal win was so well, well, was so well, well, fucking she powerful. wasn't gaming in an Arsenal battle. She wasn't gaming yeah, she in an was. Arsenal battle. She was just being yeah, disrespectful. What game what game she said? What game she said? She, was, she, said? Nah, she nah, was she, nah, she was, 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 she was flipping, flipping his name and all that shit. She was flipping the shit out of name. No, Something man, that was that was like who who the fuck I got this shit on fire, who the fuck put arson this? Like shit like that. Like she was just yeah, I thought you said, yeah, yeah, bro. That was you stepped her shit up. That was lame. That was so lame. I, okay, I, I, I'm gonna let that go, man. I guess you got. I guess, right, well, but you got I her. Think, you got you her on the list. Okay, yeah. so so let me ask you a question. Let me ask you a question. So you got QP on the list at number fourteen. So you saying yeah. she, if she is, but you going from 2015, you said up to where we yeah. at right now, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 So you saying from 2015 to where we at right now, QP make this list and she's better than, uh, she she's better than basically a lot of the people named. So you ain't named that. I have to hear the rest of this list. Who else you got on this list? Man? I think she. Who I think she would be a lot. I think she. I have no reason to believe that she wouldn't at least take a lot of these niggas and give them a like 
if not win, give him a nasty ass run. And I think she's trying to prove that and shit. So I'm saluting that. She and definitely will beat that, that I don't think and she, Jesus, she'll she'll be crazy. Crazy. You just you got it out for them today, man. <laughs> no, I just know I just know that they're not really as good as people make them think. Because they not really, because they not really, they not really that, they not really that good like that, man. I'm, I'm not won over by T Top. I'm sorry, I don't care what nobody say. I'm not won over by him. I don't think I said this before. I don't think I think he overrated. I don't think he really that bar heavy like that. I don't think he that good lately. All right, let, let's go to fifteen. I don't, 15. I, don't I think, think so. I think our number fifteen could be argued in the top ten. Also, yep. we were just doing it off the top. Agree. Our number fifteen is DNA. I think yeah. he's a top ten battler too, but we. You put I don't know. you we put Q B before D N A. See, this is where the, all the controversy gonna come in at. Who <laughs> after Q B? <laughs> who after not Q B? Yeah. Who after Q B? That's where all the controversy. You put Q B before yeah. D N A. That's horrible. Horrible. No, 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 I what, agree. I agree. What's the what's D N A's what's D N A's biggest? What would you say D N A's biggest win is since from two thousand fifteen to now? What are we? What so, are we so, so you going off win? of the name? You going off of the name? She yeah, had from well, I mean, the fish. biggest win, you know, dopest, you know, what I mean, like situation, like you, you think about his big battles that he had, like this nigga battles so much, like literally, I'm on, like I'm looking at who he's battled, Pat's and I'm like, he beat not Pat's even day, halfway right? down the page, and it's literally twenty battles between then and now. Uh, Pat, Pat State, <laughs> but. But, but what about what he did from 215 to up now? You only name it three that's battles that's you, no, that's you what he did, but this man continue to be yeah. active, man, all the time. Right. I right. just don't see it. I don't see Q. I I think not, not, I think, I don't but see I think with all. DNA, it's who you base. Like, I'm not mad at somebody putting DNA a little bit higher, but I also think for DNA, for him to be in the class that he's in, the type of battles I think like he he does have a lot of random motherfuckers that he will just take and he does beat them and shit too and we said that yesterday like he'll take a arrow or a Koji and just like fuck him up real quick and then go battle somebody you know what I mean like with a with a name and shit but as far as big battles he he battled Diz again and he battled uh uh Pat State and yeah two big battles I Briz. I mean, yeah. It's not like it, this this list is flooded with like top tier names. Like he got Rosenberg Raw fucked him up, and I think Jones arguably beat him too. People yeah, he he did, you didn't like battle. you didn't like him and Loso. I think about him and Chef Trez. That was it. Yeah, yeah. He like, got some shit like out here, bro. Chef Trez. Yeah. You can argue this guy's in the top ten. We fuck, I, I'm a bit as to the comment niggas and other like we fucked up on the DNA shit. We didn't really think about it. He could be in the top ten. You can't. Yeah, yeah, I mean you count maybe, he put maybe twenty battles back. from fifteen to to now and you probably only can make a case that he lost maybe three of them. You know what I mean? So eh, yeah. I get that. I get that. I'm not mad number at that. Si- number sixteen, we got disaster. So oh, you niggas right. need to tell Again. me you niggas mean to tell me you yeah. niggas don't like watching the Sirius Jones battle, but y'all niggas do like watching the DNA battle. All right. Man, oh, man, give me DNA any day over Sirius Jones. Yeah, I'd, rather watch watch DNA. I'd rather watch DNA. Guys, why you keep on trying to argue? Say, why are you messing up the interview, man? Oh, <laughs> my gosh. Why you keep bringing up Sirius Jones, man? He yeah, over your house? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I was saying, I was saying, I was saying, I was saying, you said some of our stuff. I had some candy bars, but you, ah, come on. No, man. Well, hold up, Trip. Hold up, Trip. Hey, got it. Like, we be saying, like, like DNA be saying a lot of the, like, it's, that style is just like, like, I right, he gets over with that shit. But well, that shit gets frustrating. You don't hear the same shit when he raps? That same? No, you try, right. no, you're trying to help out Cap. Listen, fam. No, I'm actually you take right. DNA over Sirius Jones. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. You, take out, you, no. you take DNA, DNA over Sirius Jones any day. He said he's played a machete, but you sitting there trying to clown Arsenal. Man, get the fuck out of here. 
Okay, well, here, okay, that's one lie. But here's my thing. Let's go back to your argument. You tried to say we picking DNA over Siri Joe. You think Siri Joe better than DNA? Mm-hmm. Um, horrible. 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 I think. Who, who else agree with that? Hold on, I thought, hold on, hold on. I thought Joe's won when they battled. But you said better? Better as in yeah, right. Right. Better as in, as in he won the battle. Who got the best battles? Who got the best battles, man? Who, who rapped the best? Battles? Who rapped the best? I'm going to tell you, sir. I'm going to tell you. Well, we come on 2015 up, right? Okay. Yes. Okay. Yeah. You still got to go with DNA if you say I'm saying that. Uh, he battled, he battled Jim. The court, nah, yeah, Jim. Jones, Jones had some good battles since 2015. You can't just definitely go with DNA. Why you say that? Because because uh, DNA putting in more work, man, and he got look. This man ain't only battling. The man doing two on twos, and he coming with it even in those battles. Even in those, he be snapping in those battles, man. I, I don't yeah, see dude. how you compare the two. Kind of a, you know, but hold, hold on, hold on real quick. Kind of a similar argument. I think we did this before with JC. I'm just going down a list of big battles, like uh, of names of like notable people. Uh, like you got, you got the, the Diz again. You got Sirius Jones. You know what I'm saying? That's like you got Rosenberg. You got Philly Swain, who I think also beat him. And then KG the Poet. KG the Poet, I think, beat him too. So, I don't know. And then what? Pat Pat Stay? The niggas got Pat. You got you got K G the po- you got K G the you got K G the poet beating DNA. Beating DNA, hell yeah. And I don't Oh, you I said Hanky yeah, like KG. it was that obvious? Yeah, no, shout, no, yeah. shout out to K G man. I'm not Oh no he didn't beat him bad. No, he didn't beat him bad. I, I oh, thought he was I thought he got DNA. I thought he got DNA out of there. I ain't even watched that. Okay, you oh, man. Man, man, man. Well, well, my point was that big battles, it's not, it's not like, you know what I mean, between Philly, Philly Swain and losing to Rosenberg, and oh wow, you know what I mean, like so, so Briz so, battled Briz in this time frame too, like he lost to Briz, right? That's debatable. Who DNA? Yeah, he lost to Briz. I had him losing to Briz. Okay, fair, fair. What so you we think? Mean, like Briz, like actual name about it's not. What do you think about Diz? Okay, I don't think he lost. Okay, I got to go back and watch that because I definitely didn't have Briz clearly beating DNA the way y'all just said it. Like, that's debatable. He beat him. That's debatable. DNA, they tried the same talking about he freestyled. No, that freestyle was not better than what Briz did. Briz beat him. Okay. Okay. He freestyled that second round, man. Diz at 16. What are we doing with Diz at 16? Is that a good spot for Diz? Diz, Diz definitely Diz is top 10. No, he's not. Whoever put that, whoever put that QB in there, go ahead and take a half bottle of them pills. <laughs> Real talk. <laughs> so what are we doing with Diz? Or for QB to be Arsenal and show off? Like, come on, knock it off. Yeah. And, and Diz, yeah, she ain't bad no disaster. She is not bad no disaster, fam. I don't even like you disaster, think, but she is not a bad male disaster. Who think disaster lost to an official? Who said that? I'm asking you right. who you think he did. I'm asking you the question. Do you think Dis- he did? Yeah, disaster beat official. He beat official. Uh, I had official. He beat official. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. 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 Yeah, that's what I'm I don't remember. What rounds you get? I don't remember the exact rounds I gave her, but I know I had her. Then she like fucked wow. up to look at her phone or some shit. Mm-hmm. I know. Hey, what rounds you had? Shit, like we didn't see the battles. Right, because I, I'm gonna tell you yeah, why I say that. Right. I'm gonna tell you why I say that because sometimes. I'm gonna say that because sometimes, sometimes that do matter when y'all say things. Like when I said what rounds because. I watch battles and I be knowing what rounds a lot of people win and lose in. An official, an official clearly lost the third round against DNA. I mean, not DNA disaster because she she stopped short. She she ended that round, that third round, very short. You get what I'm saying? She lost the third round out the gate. 
You know what I'm saying? So I be that's why I be saying what round. Just like when y'all said K Shine B Bird. No, he clearly gave away the third round. He didn't so, even finish it and wasn't even saying so nothing in, in the beginning. In your, in so your opinion, in your either. opinion, if I finish if I finish short, short meaning not like okay, we signed up for the battle for two thirty, I finish at two, other guy finishes at two thirty, you still saying that I lost that battle because I didn't fulfill the entire time that was allotted to me. Like fuck whoever said that. No, I'm not no, I'm not I'm not I'm not saying it like that. What I'm saying is if you got a three minute battle and you didn't wrap up a minute and thirty seconds, come on man. No, stop playing. And the other guy and it's a, and that don't really matter neither. It depends on what you're saying. Like I'm gonna give you an example. In a young okay. ill versus surf battle. Ill beat surf, but people be trying to say, Oh, Earth surf 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 beat him. Listen, man, surf stopped in two of those rounds with like forty five seconds left. And at that time that's when the clocks was on the battle. Well, why Smack stop doing that when he had the clocks on the battle where you could see the time from the beginning to the end. But anyway, the clocks was on the battle. Surf finished two of those rounds with like forty five seconds left on the clock. And at the same time, he was saying some stuff, but Ill just brought too much to the table. But sometimes that do matter when you when you end a round short and the other person just going in. You know what I'm saying? And matching what you bought in more. So yeah, sometimes it it depends. It depends. All right, let's get down this list, Battle Truth, man. Mm-hmm. Number seventeen. So you don't agree with Diz being sixteen, okay? Number seventeen, we got. No, Ill I got Will. a problem with. I got a problem with QB being over disaster and DNA. I think you gonna. I think from the rest of your list on out, you gonna run into a problem. But go ahead. So what about <laughs> Ill Will? If QB. So we'll do everything uh, with QB. Is, is Ill Will God, doing more? Damn, than I hate this. I hate this okay. now. Yeah, yeah, God. I like Ill Will better than QB easily. I had Ill Will beating Big K. I had Ill Will beating Rum Nitty. Yes, have him over, over, over uh, QB. Yes, easily. Ill Will, Ill Will or Danny? Easy. Oh, Ill Will or Danny? Oh, my God. What do you that? mean Ill... Ill Will beat Big K? What are you talking about? Come on, dude. I had Ill Will beating Big K, and I had uh, him beating Rum Nitty. That's what I mean. That's what I said. So... What about Chess? We got uh, Chess at 18. Oh, what do you, you think Chess? You think QB? Chess and QB, who's better? We got Chess at 18. We got QB at 14. Wow. The things about that, if you're going, if you, if you going by, if you're going by wins, you're going to say it's going to have to be QB. But if you're yeah. going by yeah. who rapped the best, then I guess it's, it's, I guess it's Chess. But I guess, yeah, that, I mean, you got away with that one. Put it that way. You got to be probably edge him on that one. I'm going to be yeah, honest. 19, yeah. we look fucking horrible. We got Rum Nitty at 19. 19 is, is horrible. Rum, that's 19 and 20 is horrible. Rum, Rum yeah. Nitty? Rum Nitty? Yeah. But you know what's crazy, though? That's not really horrible when you look at, like, Rum Nitty do good, but it's just saying, like, he just don't pull out the battles, man, because he did good against yep. Al, but I had Al beating him. He did good against Rock, but I had Rock beating him. He did good against Ill Will, but I had Ill Will beating him. But, dang, that's that's crazy. But I don't think it's so true. Uh, it it seems like, oh, seem like he's missing the strategic, like, this is how you win battle shit. It's like like he got the bars, not like, Romney is talented as shit. I just think when it comes to the strategy of, like, how – how he puts his shit together, like, to really beat you, take home a dub, like, it just don't be there, man. Not to me, not clear. Like, you know what I'm saying? Or do, so, or do you think or do you think it's just that people just prepare more when they go on? It, it's sort of like the Cortez factor. Cortez good in battle rap, but for some reason, people kill him, man. And it be like, dang, Core, it ain't that his material bad and he can't win with it. It's just for some yeah. reason, people just won't to beat him. And that's what right. you well, said with I mean, Nitty. I, I think, material I think that's, a slight, that. I think that's, a, that's a slightly different thing with Nitty. I, I kind of feel like it's a, probably a combination of niggas being kind of scared, so they bring their best work to the table. So that factors into it too, right? Like you know this nigga's a killer. But I just think strategy-wise, and, yeah, we're going to go back to the Rex battle. I know niggas that listen like, y'all that hate that nigga. I, that's cool. But that at the same cool. time, it's like Rex showed you this is how you win, you know what I mean? Like, this is how you win a battle. Like, I'm coming in here to battle you and beat you in this shit, and it just minimizes all that. 
at random references and guns and shit like that. You know what I mean? Like, it just minimizes a lot of that shit. But... That you know what crazy like you say you that? You know what crazy you say that, man? My guy Jahad was bugging me for the past two weeks. He said, Power Truth, we got to do the Rex dot mob cave gang vlog. I was like, okay, I'm going to get around and do it, but I kept throwing it off. Then I saw y'all done it, and it was funny. He called me on the phone. He said, I told you, we can't be slacking up. Angie fan them be on top of this stuff, man, and they just did it. I was like, you for real? He like, yes, they did it. It's up right now. I saw it. I said, I'm still <laughs> doing it. <laughs> but I say this to say this, because you brought up the wreck. I ain't even heard y'all yet because I was mad. <laughs> but I got to say this, because I don't know if y'all touched on this. I think, I don't think K-Shine ended that mob. I think it's just been over. I think it's been over. To me, I just what, think it's mom? been over. How did this, yeah, how did y'all touch on it? Wait, what, we, um, like, like when, when, did, when, when did y'all think that was the end of Dot Mob, or do y'all even think it's the end of it? I don't know. Let me ask you no. that. Let me ask you that. How do you feel? Let me ask you that, Truth. How do you feel about the new breed of Dot Mob, Show Off, Snake Eyes, uh, Bad News? Like, and, um, How do you feel about the new Dot Mob? I don't, I don't, I don't think it's go, it, it, it's not gonna work because I don't think I don't think bad news and snake eyes gonna get the opportunities that everybody else got, which means that they careers. If I'm looking at their careers right now, this new dot mob. When we looking at snake eyes and bad news and and oh, oh here's another thing. Now, Briz is dot mob, right? Oh yeah. Yeah, he is. He's not Cave Gang. He Dot Mob, right? He's he reps both. Yeah, he reps both. But when Rex brought him in, he actually got brought in as Dot Mob, though, right? Uh you know what? Val Truth, this shit to me, I think some people got dual membership. Other niggas just got the one Dot Mob membership, and I think it's all really just one big crew at the end of the day. It kind of seemed like so. That's kind of how I've been and, and, and that's why I think. That's why I think the problem come in there. See, the new wave of Dot Mob, no. No, that nobody. Listen, Rex destroyed Dot Mob. Let's just be honest. Rex destroyed Dot Mob. destroyed it? We know Moot. Yeah, yeah, he destroyed it. He destroyed it. Because at one time, Rex carried that brand, that name, and he made it marketable. He made it presentable. He made it likable. He actually made that brand mean something. And at the same time, he destroyed it. When he, see, see, what the thing about battle rap is this: at the end of the day, we still all men. And let me tell you how this also affected Daylight too. Daylight did a lot of them shenanigans over and over again to the point that we as men we outgrown him. You get what I'm saying? We outgrown him, and he's feeling the effect of it right now. You get what I'm saying? And the same thing is Rex. After him going so many times, just doing anything he wanted to do. And, and, you, and anybody know, know I was an advocate, a big advocate of Rex. Even I had to throw in the towel and be like, I'm done, man. I mean, I'm done. I'm done. He destroyed that brand. You get what I'm saying? Because he 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 he, he didn't take it serious. All these recycled bars, not performing at these battles to the point that, and at that time, you said Dot Ma, but it ain't even really a Dot Ma. Mook ain't there. Shine ain't there. Rock basically don't even really say Dot Ma. He be hollering Cave Gang all the time. He might say Dot Ma, might say it, but his thing is Cave Gang. Let's just be real. And I think wow. that's that's the new way. They just need to just leave it alone, man. They just need to leave it alone, man. And I think I think I think you just leave it alone and let Cave Gang do but, his but thing, man. Why, why are you? I take it. I understand your point. Why are you blaming the demise of Dot Mob on Rex, though? Like, why is it Rex's fault? Because Rex was the one holding the torch. Rex was holding the torch. Rex killed the brand. He, he look. He, 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 he made the fans give up on him. 
he made the fans give up on him, man. The only one, the only ones who still give him a chance is diehard battle rap fans who've been watching it for years, and the only thing they going off of is what he did a long time ago. That's all they going off of. That's all they going off of. He had many opportunities to keep that alive, and he destroyed that brand, man. Let's just be real. He destroyed that brand, man. Wow. Wow. Posey, what you think, bro? I, I, I can't. I'm not going to say all that, man, but I guess it's battle truth, man. I guess. Because you yeah, can't I, win. I got nothing for that. I got an angle, but I know I can't win with battle truth. He, <laughs> no, he no, say that shit. Say that shit, bro. What's that? Say it. I feel like Tay Rock is still holding down the brand, man. I feel like he's still the face of Dot. Like we can't, it ain't no way you could destroy Dot Mob, in my opinion. You can't, man. It's yeah, too much of. Yeah, a I mean, it, if Dot Mob is essentially claiming Cave Gang too as affiliates under, you know what I mean, under the whole banner, then it's like you got to incorporate Briz and Av and YK and all of them guys that are in Cave Gang too. Like, that's how it was presented to me. I could be wrong about this shit, but this is how I was presented with the situation. Because I'm pretty sure but that's if, not... if Briz, is, well, Wait. if uh, Av is main event somewhere or YK is somewhere, you know what I mean? Like, they're going to be on, like, it's going to be Dot Mob and all of them niggas on stage, right? Like, I, I don't know. It, it I don't think it matters still... no more. And, 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 and I'm going to tell you something, something that's real. You have to you have to separate Cave Gang from Dot Mob now. You have to because Cave Gang is something that the battle rap community is appreciating. That Dot Mob brand they not appreciating. The fans are fed up with Mook doing all these interviews, talking this and that, ain't jumping in the ring. Rex not giving performances. <laughs> Uh, 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 not, 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 not coming with bars, giving up on battle, and this K. Shine battle basically just, just was a done deal. It was a done deal. You had everybody boosted up, fired up. I'm talking about this was just a done deal. You, you look. If anybody's smart in business, you have to separate that K. Gang brand from that Dot Mob brand because it's going to taint it and destroy it. And then if you think about, and if you think about what's going on with K. Gang, and like I said, when you listen to Rock and Battle, they don't really holler that Dot Mob like that, man. He holler K. Gang, man. That's when he be hollering, man. Even though he may say, yeah, you know, I'm a die, this and that, maybe on an interview. He don't even really do interviews. But his stuff be K gang. That's what he be talking about for the most. That's what they up here up uplifting up whole. And I just think, man, if being smart, I think Rex and them need to retire that name, man. You have to retire that Dot Mob name because Jeez, who nah, ain't gonna nah, battle nah, no more. Nah, that's nah, nah, the truth. Right. That's no, I'm far. keeping it real. That's that's real. Far. I mean, I, no, look, it's I, not I think, because think listen, listen. Your... Oh, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay, go ahead. I'm respecting. I'm respecting your opinion. And I, I'm just like, I'm hearing you out completely. And honestly, there's a lot of people saying, talking about the separation between, you know, Dot Mob and, and, and Cave and shit like that. But when you say they should retire, like they make music, they're an actual crew of real niggas from Harlem. Like it's not just in, a lot of them don't even rap type shit. Like, so it's more than just the battle rap. You know what I'm saying? Like it, it's a lot more to it. It's kind but of. I was just saying from battle rap. I was just saying from battle rap. And if you I want to put it in battle, battle rap. rap, I wasn't saying from the other stuff. I was just saying from battle, battle rap. rap. They need to retire from battle rap. This how I see it for ba- uh, like battle rap. Like it's as far as street battle rap. We ain't talking about the, the supernatural and all the grind. As far as street battle rap, Dot Mob is like uh, they like the foundation. They like the Lakers are the Celtics. If you remove the, even though the Lakers is not doing too good right now, it's like a dynasty type of team. If you move the Boston Celtics and the Lakers from the NBA. It's weird. Like what? Yeah, These are two so teams. No, who, but you retire. But you retire your numbers man. so you won't hurt the brand. You retire. You retire the brand so that it can mean something rather than tarnishing it where it don't mean nothing no more. That's you why think when on the current path, like that, okay, that this is this is a good point. You think on the current path that Dot Mob is on, that brand won't mean as much to people down the line. So it's best to just get get rid of it now while you see it sinking. That's that is that your point? That, that that's point exactly why. Cause think about the new okay. think about the new guys you brought on. You said Snake Eyes, Bad News, Show Off. Show off ain't even with mm-hmm. the URL, right? Right? Mm-hmm. So what yeah. do that mean? What do that even mean? So and now now think about this. 
do you see snake eyes and, and, and bad and, and bad news that he would judge on them, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, he is. He's John John. So he would bull yeah. pin, show off with R B E, Snake Eyes, basically he with U R L. What do you see them really doing? Think about it. What do you see them at two, three years from here? What do you see them at? Honestly. Them three names I just named. What do you see them doing two, three years from Snake, here? You Snake even said with a big battle. name battle. I mean, um, what do I see? Three years, that's a long, that's forever in battle rap. That was just amazing. Right, it's but you're proving ago. the point. You can't even see them I'm doing not, good not in three years, years like I'm that. Not, I'm not, though. I'm <laughs> saying it's unpredictable. Three okay, years come, on with, it. come on with time, it. Come bro. on with it. There's right. no come on with it because three years is forever <laughs> in life right now, right. let alone fucking battle rap, my nigga. I can't even remember what happened last month, let alone three fucking, you know what I mean? Like, bro, three years? We, you never know. Shaw could be back right. in the URL doing his thing. Bad news could be there, like, and so could Snake Eyes. He's currently signed to him right now. But his thing, but who do they get? Who do, okay, but who do they get in three years? Do you see them getting big, a big name, a real big name within three years? When what, when what you see them got right now and all the talent that's already, see, you got to think about it this. Smack them got a lot of mouths to feed. Let's just be real. They got a lot of mouths to feed and a lot of people hands out. So with that being said, you got Snake Eyes, Bad News, Show Off. Who do they cut in front of to get that to get that payout? Who do they? Because that's what it's gonna come of. down to. Because you're talking about yeah, smack, yeah. Because that's what it comes down bad to. Bad news and somebody just made this point in the group. Bad news and show off are top guys on the leagues that they currently occupy. Unless you're gonna say, well, if they're not on smack, this doesn't. All of this shit doesn't matter. Unless you're gonna say that, then I don't like. I don't get the point of saying, well, well, what are these guys gonna be doing on smack? Like. They're, they're not there right now, and for from where I'm sitting, bad news. I, I think a lot of rappers who want to be like up and coming battlers and shit, especially new guys. Well, bad news is that it's not a bad position. Like Show Off is getting clearly getting names, clearly getting top tiers and shit like that. I think he might end up going back to URL and shit like you know what I mean. Like it, it would make sense. So I, I just don't. So I don't so know. You think, I don't know so you think he's gonna drop the contract I, killer? I so you think he dropping the contract killer to get with the URL? You think what? I don't I don't understand the question. He's dropping the contract killer that he be wearing the shirt. Contract killer, you know that's from the URL, guess. You think he dropping that to be with the URL? I don't I don't know. <laughs> I mean, I I would I I think he's probably considering the shit because I I don't know if he gains anything extra by continuing to be on RBE killing shit when I think. He's ready. Like, we're ready to see the show-off experiment happen on the main stage. Like, Battle Rap is ready to see that. And RB, as great as they are, is not going to give him a room of 2,000 people to make go crazy and say his slogan like they lost their fucking minds. Like, he's ready for that look, I think. So we should have... That's going to be a bad... Exactly. If he do go to URL, that's going to look bad because he stood firm on that RBE. Like, yo, I'm never... This is my man, Adam... Like, it's going to look bad if you go to URL. They don't even like RBE. Like, so, well, didn't, yeah, didn't, they they clear. Uh, didn't they say, but didn't he say, you know what, it'll have to be anything I do will have to be worked out with ARP. <laughs> like, he didn't say, he didn't you, rule out going back. But, but you think Beasley you know and they're going to talk to ARP like, yo, like, that don't even make sense. Like, Sam no. Dorff do go over there. So Beasley going to no, help you build up. They're going to help. Adam, build up, show off. That don't even sound right. I'm going to help ARP build up, show off. That don't even sound Which right. Which was one so of like their arguments. Never... This is a great point. This is a great point. Which was also one of their arguments of saying why they didn't really want to put head ice on a URL because he a King got a dot brand. So we don't want to brand King got a dot now. Come on now. Stop it. Because it's like yeah, you helping King got a dot game. build up ice. It's like you helping him. Unless uh, so so it has to be a, on a contract. Ah, uh, okay. All right. I got you. That's I think Dot Mob them just retire the Dot Mob as a battle rap thing right now. And let Cave Gang do their thing, man. If I if, if I'm if I'm smart, I humble myself and I let Cave Gang do their thing, man. Since they since Rex said he lost the love, Newt lost the love. Okay, that was Dot Mob. Retire yeah. the brand. Let Cave Gang do their thing, man. Let Cave Gang do their thing. You can't say Snake Eyes, New Wave, and all. They ain't even getting good looks like that, man. 
We tired of names. Let Rock do his thing, man. So you so <laughs> so the whole cave cave gang and dot mob being affiliated the way that they are doesn't change the way you think about dot mob overall, right? Like it's no, but like the, the I mean I yeah. mean. You, I mean, if you think about it like this, this basically what all these cliques got in common. They all cool with certain. They all cool with certain league owners that get them the advantage. NWF cool with Beasley. Dot Mob mm-hmm. Cave Gang cool with Smack. North basically working with the PGs. That's how they go. They all got favor with the league owners in some type of way that give them the advantage to be on cards, okay? That's basically how all these cliques are set up and why people join these cliques, because it's favor with the bosses. So? Even North agreed to this. You get what I'm saying? I even wait, wait, asked North that. Like, what? Yeah, jo- joining, a, joining a group helps you automatically be No, he agreed to this. He agreed to that why a lot of them are in position to continually be on cards because of their relationships with them personally. You get what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Per- yeah. Cause K-Shine them on interviews talking about how they always be at beach. We have playing games and eating and stuff and kicking it with them. So you always yeah. see an NWX on the card. Then yeah, you know, you, you think, do you think that's right K-Gang, or wrong? That's you- smack- what you say? You think that's right or wrong? You think that's right or wrong? Using your personal relationship with somebody to to get to like advance your career. You know what I mean? No, it, it ain't wrong. It ain't wrong for the clicks, but it's actually it's definitely wrong for the league owners. It ain't wrong for a click. Like if I'm rock and smack my guy, and I got cave gang, and I'm in good time with smack. No, I mean that's what you do. It, it's sort of like at a job. Mm-hmm. It's his butt to get promoted. Now. Now, as a league on that smack, you got to know that all these people on these contracts, whether they're in clicks or not, these are your employees, so you got to be fair for everybody. But we also know in battle rap, the name of the game is called supply and demand. If you hot, you go on the card regardless. If you a ticket seller, mm-hmm. you go on that card regardless because you fill in and seats and people are paying to see you. But at the same time, you owe the obligation to the rest of your employees, too. And that's why a lot of these guys, I, I doubt that Av really wanted to join Dotmar. Uh, I mean, I mean, cave gang, but because of the really? the benefits in it, in it to get you on more cards to make more money and better opportunities, you join clicks, man, and that's what they doing. I mean, a lot of the guys in cave gang, like, okay, so Av and Ryder, for instance, are actually from around the area, and I'm pretty sure Rock and uh, like, you know, from the interviews we have with Av and like just me actually, you know, chopping up with him at the events and shit, like he. He's them rocking the niggas. They've known each other for like forever, type shit. Like so, yeah. you know what I mean? Like it wasn't like it was out of nowhere, and he just was like, "All right, I'm gonna fuck with him." But they all been cool, type shit. So, uh, I I don't know about that one too. That's the it's, it's, the click shit. Yeah, man, I'm a you battle rapper. No, no, no new battler. Yo, like bro, like don't join. Like don't do it. I, I don't. I don't. I don't. I don't right. think niggas should be trying to jump to do that right now. Like, right, because yeah. it's battle rap. Right. As a battle rapper, what battle rapper say? I'm going to be a battle rapper and I'm going to join that group. No, it's a battle rapper. I want to kill everybody. Everybody fair game. You, since when do we you join battle rap to be a part of a team of clicks? Man, yeah, they, they weren't doing that stuff. Now, if, when you were doing battle rap, you were like Dot Mob. They was already a click and team before the battle rap thing. So they came in as a team. Now you got people who... Who, who I'm going to be a battle rapper, and I'm joining a clique now. you like, okay, you a battle rapper. Why are you joining people? With, if you ain't already been with them, why are you joining them coming in as a battle rapper? Who does that? Come on, stop it. That's crazy. Yeah. yeah. So, 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 um, all right, well, that's, that's stupid, this fucking, that, he said he respects, man said he respects Chess more than Briz and Top. Why? But, because Chess knows. Chess is cool with Steams and all them, and you know, like, ah, I, I, I don't know. This, this is a little yeah. weird. Who said that? The crew, the crew shit is a little bit weird because he's making a distinction between Chess and and Briz and T Top. I do feel, I feel like T Top to NWX that struck me as a little bit random. Like if you want to talk about a random signing, <laughs> that shit is random as fuck, bro. Like, I don't get it. I right. thought him and Briz was going. Why anything, don't nobody? Why don't nobody him and Briz wanna... was going to click up and and form that and form that Southern movement and give us that like like we got the Midwest movement. Like I'm Our still mad about that. Yeah. 
Yeah, like, like why don't why don't nobody want to like, join takes up? <laughs> that's like why don't nobody want to join takes up? That's a that's a very New York uh, group, New York based group. They they all are mad cool with each other type shit. Like they actually fuck with each other. You know what I mean? Like, and I also I think it's because it's a New York group. Like, it's a lot of random New York hate. I'm sorry. Like, not this is a separate thing entirely. I don't get the random New York hate lately. Like, I, I don't get it, especially the last couple of years. The shit is kind of it's kind of fucking me up right now. Like. When you can, New York, you can man. literally go to any club or listen to any radio station, you hear more shit from other regions than our shit. And all these kids out here, like, bumping, like, southern music nonstop, but you hear niggas saying New York is this and that. Like, I right. just, I'm bad. I'm bad. Different subject altogether. Yeah, New York, man. Well, I'm well, not taking I, a lot of angry. Because <laughs> I'm, I'm tripping, like, why? 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 I'm just trying to see why Steams and Chuck the only members of Cake Up. <laughs> oh, nah, it's more. It's, it's more right? than them, bro. It's more like cool. Who else with them? I, I'm missing something. You're not gonna them? know these. Fill me you're in. not gonna know these names, bro. You're not gonna know these names. Okay, just um, fill, fill us in. You, you know, ain't only look. You, know, know, you, you gotta know, keep you in mind. You're not only stuff, speaking you know? to me. You're speaking to the audience. Mo Mula. Mo Mula. Shout out yeah. to Mo Mula. He was cool. the girl. Shout out yeah. to Mo Mula. Yeah, Mo Mula. you gotta say who. Mo, okay, Mo, go ahead. Mo Mula. Oh, you gotta say who. Yeah, go ahead. Yeah. Yes. You so said, you Mo, you said Mo Mula. Yes, yeah, Mo that's Mula. the name. Yeah. He had a ball yet? Yeah. He was he on URLs. He, he had a born legacy. Uh, yeah, I'm saying, I'm saying, have he had a battle yet? Yes, yes he, he was. Mostly. He was booked yeah. for Born Legacy three, but his opponent didn't show up. He was booked for Born Legacy three versus uh Young X. Yeah. Young X uh, couldn't make okay. it. Do you like he him? Got some shit. Yeah, he. I, I think he's dope. Okay. His last, his last so battle. Three of them. Probably, you, oh, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, because you said you never heard of him, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna tell you a battle you should check out from him. He got he battled this dude named Sin Fleet on fucking We Go Hard, and that performance was pretty dope. <laughs> You, 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 you,